without investing real effort into making sure that we and hold time. hands and, and time, and time yes. quality time, not just, oh, we've been there in their life for the past 30 years, or but it could uh, amount I've to nonsense. I've been paying fees. I've been paying school fees. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it, 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 it's, wow. it's, it's crazy. Yeah. yeah, and that's what people, people try to interpret being present as, you know, other things, materially, yeah, like, you know, yeah. we, we pay school fees, you know, we give enough pocket money. Why they're going to school and they're getting into drugs, we don't know. We were not smoking weed or things like that, yeah. but they are doing it now. Yeah. I mean, look, good character is not genetical. Good no. character is influence. social education yes. and uh, you get to see your child because the child goes into class at 8, yeah. leaves at 4 o'clock, by the time they come in they do homework, you have rushed from work, yeah. you don't sit down to actually do homework with them, mm -hmm. you don't sit down to engage the child, mm -hmm. find out yeah. what happened in school yeah. because their social cy cycle mm -hmm. is mostly the, 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 the school, yeah. mostly the teachers yes. and the friends they make are in their school. Yeah. There's children that they are in the estate, they'll probably interact with them in the evening for about an hour or mm -hmm. over the weekend. Yes. You don't engage the child. Probably after, and I, I like the fact that you say that it's the influence yes. that we have. The child doesn't follow what you say more than what you do. Yes. What you do, so you what are the they example. see you do. They say yeah. you do it, they will copy, like monkeys, like yes. apes. Yes. Exactly. Monkey see? Monkey, Monkey do. do. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. And, and, and to big man, I mean, uh, you know this as, as much as I do in the current society and the breed of men that we are. It's, it's, it's what do you say? A, it's quite astonishing. Um, yeah. You know, there are both the positives of what technology has played. Yes. And, uh, the bo technology has really played uh, positively and also negatively impacted uh, society of nowadays. We, uh, you know, when you look at it critically, you yeah. find that the youth nowadays don't realize, um, you know, when you're talking about the youth, they don't realize the importance of um, having their own targets, running their own race. And as, um, you know, the greatest Maradona who said, no man is limited. No, he also Eliud. said, uh, Eliud Kipchoge, hmm. he also said that respect the race, respect, respect the, the race. distance. Yes. Yeah? So many youth right now don't respect the distance. When they see people flaunting money left, right, center, they, they, want to they, they see now. Yeah, they, they see, see now. now. Yeah. In order for we as youth to become successful and in order for us to be productive in society, um, there's a simple formula that I, uh, I read somewhere. Yes. Um, it talked about um, success, how to, to make sure that you succeed. Mm -hmm. So you, you add, uh, you, you multiply um, planning mm -hmm. and then well, actually it is. It is talent plus um, planning mm -hmm. 
multiply by action and uh, association. Yes. And then all of it cumulatively, you add faith. So if you plan yourself well, and everybody has his or her own God-given talent, that means you know your strengths, you know your weaknesses. Yes. After that, you multiply it with the action. Are you really doing whatever you're dreaming? And, and that you're is doing? aligned. Yes. That is aligned. Yes. And then if you're, you're acting on it, are you, are you doing whatever you wanted to do? And then association. How, may, how, how, how do you associate with people? What is your circle? You know, they say that, uh, you know, show me your friends and I will uh, tell you your, your character. Your networks are your net worth. Yes, exactly. And then you accumulate it uh, with faith. So you believe in yourself, associate with the, the right people, have the same, um, you know, you have the, the, the action towards whatever you're doing. At the end of it all, you'll find yourself that, uh, you'll find yourself in a position where you grow. And that is what the youth fail to see nowadays. They do not respect the distance. True. Yeah. And, and, and you know what, uh, as, as it's said, that part of growing up, is being responsible yeah. for your actions. Exactly. And in a nutshell, what you're trying to, uh, you know, w w exactly what you're actually mentioning, and, and it's absolutely uh, valid, uh, you know, uh, yeah. um, I mean, uh, equation right there. Yeah. He talks about the whole um, ideas that revolve around, yes, exploitation, identification and exploitation of talent. Exactly. You know? Yeah. And then, obviously, talent, obviously, talent on its own cannot just stand. Associations we're talking about here and the power of connections, mm -hmm. as um, Margaret Whitley did say, you know, when we yeah. seek for connections, we restore the earth to wholeness. Mm -hmm. Our seemingly separate lives become more meaningful when we suddenly realize how yeah. necessary we are to each other. Son has got friends, and, and kids will, 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 will get to identify with people that also pronounce their talents here and there, mm -hmm. and they get into clubs. Yeah. Big man is tired right here. Are you? Yeah, and they get to identify with, with the people that also support their, and even from that tender age. And the mistakes that you also make is for those associations and those networks that even our kids get to start to hatch and, and to, to travel, you know, their business or life with, mm -hmm. we don't get involved. And I was, I was actually very interestingly challenged the other day that we got to know their friends. Yeah. Know their friends because that's what's going to inspire them. Yeah. Know them by name, know, know their aspirations, know where they're coming from, know their parents, stuff like that. Yeah. Because you, we cannot live detached from each other's associations and then we, we assume that we'll travel the business or life together. And obviously to, to, to also promote that um, uh, you know, continuity yes. in life. Because it's a handover race. And that handover, I think fairly much right now, is broken. And those breakdowns in that kind of continuity is what's um, getting the voids filled by so many things. So we have a generation that's cut off from the awareness of the other generation. Yeah. And so with those kind of breakdowns, we have other things filling the gap. Yes. The youths cannot connect with the middle generation. And so what fills in that gap? You know, the associations with each other yeah. and the social media yeah. and the equipment and technology that they have in their hands and which they, they're able to now interact with other people. It's not their own their own schemes. I am sure, so I'm it sure, kills I'm us. Sure, I'm sure, Irene, you can, you can testify that um, yeah. right now when you even go into the rural areas to yeah. visit uh, you know, our grandparents, yes. most of us are glued to our phones. Yeah. Uh, there's even it's no reason as to why you go visit. There's no reason as to why you, you, you go put visit. Your phone by down and you literally put it aside and have an engagement. But what happens yeah. in, the, in most cases? No, everybody's on their phone and everybody's yeah. taking selfies. You're yes. taking the selfies. We with with, with goats and people don't even know the animals <laughs> in the village. They selfie with goats and yeah. cows. And, yes, and, 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 they and, and they're and, with the and, kuni and all and, that. And they post yeah. them on social media yeah. or to friends who are, that are half a world away. Yeah. And they cannot connect with the people that they've gone to visit. Their the main village. objective their main object. visit their relatives. <laughs> yes. But at the end of the day, yeah. they're disconnected. Why? <laughs> because this, the breakdown, as you're saying, yeah. the breakdown from generation to generation. Yes, How yes. did this generation pass the button to the next generation? Yeah. And that is what I think uh, this conversation is all about. Yeah. yeah. Absolutely. Baba, you, you seem a bit bored. So what's, what could be going what, How would you want to... What are, you, what are, your, what are, what are your interests? Um, how would you want to, the school to be like, um, your mates, can, can they benefit from this, this kind of discussion? Your, your, your friends who are not doing well, uh, who are not very disciplined, what, what, do you, what do you say to them? I want my friends to be disciplined yes. and have good morals. Yes. And always to go in exams. To be good in, yeah, to pass the exams, you pass exams, what happens in general? 
like uh, if you want to become someone who's good in the society what what would you do as a, as a, as a you know as a young person like you I would pass exams mm -hmm. do good in school yes and get surprises yeah and and which means you're imagining things right yeah. well you know I hear you really good in and and I can see you're really good in technology and things like that what what do you think that would help can, can help you with? Huh? What do you think that can help you with Techno technology? Yes. Can help me to be an engineer. Yes. And it can help me to go to the army. To go to the army? Yes. Why, why the army? Because the army has good technology but not that good technology. So you want to be the guy who would want to go create very good technology for the army? And, and why you want to help your nation? Yes. And help, uh, you know, the good people to live in peace? Yes. That's a great inspiration, man. Wow. That's, that's, that's great. So, uh, and, and that's, that's the power of visualization, right? And I think it's a huge influence because of, you know, backgrounds. And, and, and goes without saying, you can pretty much see directly here that if we were to stand somewhere on an altar, mm -hmm. our kids definitely get to feed off our energies of the people we around the, them. We are the blueprint. We are the blueprint. So if you are a bad, if you are a guy who's hiding in the bushes, yeah. uh, you know, and, and playing hard and sick with the police because, oh, it's curfew and you just yeah. want to have one too many, yeah. you know, in, in peace <laughs> or hiding the ceiling. It's, it's, it's our kids that feed off that kind of energy. So it's yeah. negative energy, they get it. If it's positive energy and they feel you're someone they can look up to, what do you, what do you think? Actually, I'd, I'd like to just, as a parent, Yes. You see this kind of engagement you've seen yes. yeah. between Byron and Billy? Yes. Yeah. That kind of engagement. We don't get that kind of engagement between parents <laughs> and children. It is always a lecture right. here, an instruction there, and yeah. do this, do that. Like a, like in prison, <laughs> we always say we, have, we, are, we are like prison wardens. You're yes. always giving instructions, giving instructions. Yeah, you go to some homes and it look, looks like that. Are yeah, we yeah, engaging yeah. these children? Are we, do we know yeah. what they want to do? Yeah. Do you know what they do with their day? Mm -hmm. Do you do you know what are their aspirations? Yeah. Do you help them to guide them? Do we listen? We mm -hmm. actually hardly ever listen. Yeah. A lot of times, by the way, when you hear that children have committed suicide, yes, it's usually because they say, "My, they, you do not listen to me. You do not hear me. You do not see mm -hmm. me," and it's true. I have a good friend. Mm -hmm. She engages her children. I actually always tell her that I love the way you have conversations with your children. Yeah. It looks like she's a little crazy, mm -hmm. but I love the way she engages, engages her children because we don't do that. It's out of the norm mm -hmm. for us to have a back and forth conversation where we're talking, oh, how was your day? Mm -hmm. What did you do during school today? Uh, how is your friend? This and that. I like the fact that you, mm -hmm. it's important yeah. to have the... Um, uh, to have the, the to ask your child who are your friends and what do they do and what are yeah. their interests and you know even know their parents yeah, yeah. that's actually important because that's engaging you just know who they interact true with. and mm -hmm. so i feel uh, the, the conversation starts at that very very basic level big yeah. man as as we can that's clearly true. see with the di dissection of this topic um, it's, it's that the conversation can only start productively at a point where we feel that the connections that we need to uh, spruce up in the society are actually given a, a little bit a fair share of um, you know uh, consideration and close scrutiny uh, in order to to bind the society together uh, trust me if it's the broken moral com compasses then they can be fixed and the whole idea of a society that's reeling in a bad inertia can be redressed and altogether remedied this conversation will keep keep going on on this um, a platform and please do remember to join in uh, and, and sharing the richness of this conversation by giving that uh, all uh, too important feedback and, and, and share this out there. You know, this can actually be the whole saving power to someone out there who's possibly having serious challenges with uh, just doing that kind of connection with uh, themselves and of course with the people around them, be it family, friends, and whoever is in their lives that's gonna be uh, the jail to get this society back on track. This is Byron Adera. And remember, it's uh, at the Byron Adera on my socials and Adera Big Panther. You see such kind of violence also propagating and escalating. Yeah. And usually then you see it, 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 the, the, our kids are seeing the same thing. Respecting the distance and respecting yourself as a person will pretty much play 
a big role in enabling you to understand yourself better. Uh, the bad habits um, that, that crop up and, and seem to stay with us mm -hmm. are quite quite breeze into us, you know, it's very easy and he says it's very, very easy to actually adopt and, and quite go on with other habits, yeah. you know, as opposed to good habits. Yeah.